The Electronic Entertainment Expo 2014 was the 20th Electronic Entertainment Expo held. The event took place at the Los Angeles Convention Center in Los Angeles, California. It began on June 10, 2014, and ended on June 12, 2014, with 48,900 total attendees. Major exhibitors included Microsoft Corporation, Nintendo, and Sony Computer Entertainment. Exhibitors host their own press conferences usually one day prior to the E3 event, but some companies issued additional information an extra day prior this time. Topic: <laughs> Press conferences. Microsoft Microsoft hosted a press conference on June 9 at 9.30 am PDT. Trailers for Forza Horizon 2, Rise of the Tomb Raider, Evolve, Dragon Age, Inquisition, Sunset Overdrive, Project Spark, Ori and the Blind Forest, Halo 5, Guardians, Scalebound, A New Character for Killer Instinct, Season 2, A Phantom Dust Reboot and Crackdown 3 were revealed. There was also gameplay footage of Assassin's Creed Unity, Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, Sunset Overdrive, The Witcher 3, Wild Hunt and Tom Clancy's The Division. Halo, The Master Chief Collection, Scalebound and Dance Central Spotlight were announced as well. <laughs> Electronic Arts Electronic Arts hosted a press conference on June 9 at 12 p.m. PDT. Among the new titles shown were the role-playing game Dragon Age, Inquisition and Mass Effect 4, the action-adventure title Mirror's Edge, Catalyst and Star Wars, Battlefront, the first-person shooter Battlefield Hardline and the life simulation game The Sims 4. AIA Sports announced a number of new releases, such as Madden NFL 15, NBA Live 15, FIFA 15, NHL 15 and AIA Sports PGA Tour. Two untitled projects from Criterion Games and BioWare were also announced. <laughs> Ubisoft Ubisoft hosted a press conference on June 9 at 3 p.m. PDT. Upcoming action-adventure games included Tom Clancy's The Division, The Crew, Valiant Hearts, The Great War and the sequels Assassin's Creed Unity and Far Cry 4. Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six, Siege and Just Dance 2015 were also announced during the conference. Sony Sony hosted a press conference on June 9 at 6 p.m. PDT. The new CEO of SCEA was officially introduced as Sean Layden. An all-new white version of the PlayStation 4 was shown bundled with Destiny to be released at launch of the game. Announcement trailers were shown for PlayStation exclusives Bloodborne by From Software, Little Big Planet 3 by Sumo Digital, and Uncharted 4: A Thief's End by Naughty Dog, among others. Trailers were also shown for Grand Theft Auto 5, Dead Island 2, No Man's Sky, Destiny, Mortal Kombat X, Far Cry 4, Batman, Arkham Knight, Metal Gear Solid 5, The Phantom Pain, and others. Sony also announced an original TV series to be produced based on Powers. Topic: <inaudible> Nintendo. Nintendo for a second consecutive E3 decided to forego hosting a traditional press conference in favor of a pre-recorded announcement, build the Nintendo Digital Event, which streamed online on June 10 at 9 a.m. PDT with an accompanying press release. 
anchored by Nintendo of America COO Reggie Fils Aime and featuring stop motion sketches from the producers of Robot Chicken. The digital event primarily followed a documentary format with game footage and trailers accompanied by short interviews with developers. During this event, Nintendo showcased upcoming titles including Super Smash Bros. for Nintendo 3DS and Wii U, Yoshi's Woolly World, Bayonetta 2 from Platinum Games, KOEI Tecmo's Zelda spin off Hyrule Warriors, and Xenoblade Chronicles X by Monolith Soft, among others. First time reveals included the next Legend of Zelda for Wii U, Mario Maker, Captain Toad, Treasure Tracker, Kirby and the Rainbow Curse, multiplayer shooter Splatoon and an early look at the newest Star Fox title for Wii U. The digital event also featured the debut of Nintendo's NFC platform, revealed as Amiibo. List of notable exhibitors This is a list of major video game exhibitors who made appearances at E3 2014. Topic: List of games. This is a list of notable titles that appeared at E3 2014.